assalamu alaikum uh, today we we'll start the slavery plan chapter 11 uh, slavery plan mein kya kya padhenge definition classification of uh, slavery plants anatomy of slavery plant development of slavery plants structure of slavery plants histology of major slavery plants saliva and clinical considerations definition what is a slavery plant these are compound tubular exocrine plants found in oral cavity that secrete complex fluid known as saliva classification of slavery plants based on size based on type of secretory cells exocrine and mesocrine plants based on size uh, types of plants uh, number one is a major slavery plant and second is a minor slavery plant major slavery plants collection of secretory cells aggregated into large bilaterally paired extra oral plants with a standing duct system through which the gland secretions push them out three types of the major slavery plants parotid slavery gland uh, submandibular gland and sublingual gland minor slavery plants are uh, these are smaller slavery glands confined to the mucous coat of the oral cavity these glands usually consist of small groups of secretory units opening with short ducts directly into the mouth the main functions of these glands is not to produce saliva but to secrete minor amounts of saliva onto the mucosal surface to keep the mucosa mucosa moist these include uh, labial glands buccal glands palatine glands also palatine glands well uh, glands and uh, incisive uh, gland on type of secretory cells as pehle kya tha major types of slavery gland uh based on type of secretory cells number one is a serous kya hoga parotid gland these the mucus submandibular theek hai isme aapka serous bhi hoga aur mucus bhi hoga dono uh, combined ho gaye aur third mein kya hai mucus jisme aapke minor slavery glands mucus and mix glands uh, these slavery glands which produce a thin watery secretion are called the serous glands for example parotid gland mucus gland is one which secretes thick viscous substance called as mucus for example minor slavery glands a mix gland is one which produces both serous and mucus secretions sub mandibular Mesocrine and mesocrine glands, when secretory products passes through the cell walls, losing the cytoplasm, it is called as a mesocrine gland. And mesocrine gland, if the secretory product is carried away by the ducts leading from the gland, uh, when then that uh, gland is said to be exocrine glands. Mesocrine uh, is a term used to classify exocrine glands and their secretions in the study of histology. A cell classified as mesocrine if the secretions of that cell are uh, excreted with exocytosis from secretory cells into an epithelial wall duct, or ducts, and then uh, onto a watery surface or into the lumen. Mesocrine glands uh, that produce and then secrete substances on uh, to an epithelial surface by way of other examples of mesocrine glands include red slavery gland, slavery memory, uh, uh, mucus, lacrimal, cerebellus, and uh, mucus. Mesocrine glands are one of two types of glands in the human body. The other being endocrine glands. Which secrete their products directly into the bloodstream. 
The liver and the pancreas are both exocrine and the endocrine glands. They are exocrine glands because they secrete products while and pancreatic juice into the gastrointestinal tract through a series of ducts and endocrine because they secrete other substances directly into the bloodstream. This is the development of slidic gland. Slidic gland is development cancer. Six stages. Number one stage, bud formation. First stage is metabolic bud formation. Second, what is it? Formation and growth of epithelial cord. And third stage, initiation of branching in terminal parts of uh, epithelial cord. And uh, fourth, branching of epithelial cord and uh, lobule formation. Stage five, what is it? Canalization. Or stage six, what is it? Cytodifferentation. Now, uh, stage one, bud formation. Formation, how is it okay? Develops as proliferation of oral epithelium into underlying ectomism kind condensing around bud. A thin basal lamina separates the bud from underlying mesen kind. Interaction of the epithelium with underlying condensing Mesenchyme associated with salivary gland provide optimum environment for gland formation. So stage one hai, is bhi kya hai? Ab, wo, but formation. Second is the formation and growth of epithelial bud. Formation of the epithelial bud into the underlying mesenchyme result in long epithelial cord. The mesenchyme around the developing glandular epithelium also proliferates. Basal lamina is believed uh, to play a role on in, uh, influencing the morphogenesis and differentiation of the slivery gland. Stage 3, initiation of branching in terminal parts of epithelial cord. Epithelial cord proliferates and uh, its end branches into bulbs. Okay, stage me kya ho jayega? Kya aapke branches manna shuru ho jayenge? Stage 4, branching of epithelial cord and lobule formation. The middle ends branch extensively forming numerous bulb like formation. Ectomism time component uh, deposition within glads apparently uh, uh, to establish them. Connective tissue component below epithelial cord forms the capsule and strong synthetic gland. Hypothesis, uh, these are uh, epithelial mesenchyma interactions, uh, fibroblast growth factor family and their receptors transforming growth factor B. Differential contraction of acting uh, filaments at the basal and the epithelial ends of the epithelial cells. Five is the canalization. Lumen formation takes place uh, at the distal ends of the uh, cord, then the proximal, and at last in central part. Lumen forms within the ducts before they develop within the terminal parts. Apoptosis of centrally located cells. Rates of proliferation of outer and inner layers of uh, epithelial cord, secretion of fluid by ductal cells, which increases the hydrostatic pressure. Stage six: uh, cytodifferentiation following human formation in the terminal birds, epithelial consists of two layers of cells. The cells 
are differentiated into mucus or serous cells depending upon type of specific gland. Some of the outer cells of epithelium differentiate into myeloepic, myoepithelial uh, cells uh, that uh, are present around secretory and herpes and uh, integrated ducts. Portion of epithelial bud close to the oral cavity forms main excretory duct. Distal portion forms secretory and and face by face. This epithelial parenchyma increase in size, connective tissue component around them dimensions and remains as a thin layer. Thicker portion or partition of connective tissue septa. Uh, continues with the capsule and uh, within which uh, run nerves and uh, blood vessels supply in the gland. Tissue. Uh, gland photo 6 are uh, week of uh, intrauterine life. The mandibular six week of intrauterine life. Sublingual and uh, minor slavery gland, eight week of intrauterine life. Uh, maturity of uh, secretory and pace uh, during last two months of uh, gestation. gestation. Secretory component of gland continues to grow postnatally uh, while as a ductal connective tissue component and vascular component decreases up to two years of age. Stages of the development of the slavery gland. First stage is the uh, bud formation. This is the bud formation. Second uh, is the pod formation. That is the branching of pods. Okay. Okay. First, bud formation. Second, pod formation. Third, branching of the pods. Fourth is the uh, uh, two formations. Okay the formation and uh, fifth me kya hai canalization of cards theek hai aapke ye branches banna shuru ho gayi hai this one and uh, uh, six cyto differentiation aapki jo uh, this one cyto differentiation isme aapke uh, 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 jo uh, parts hain uh, jo uh, ducts hain wo separate ho gayi hai theek hai this one cyto differentiation Six stages. One is the bud formation. Second is the uh, cord formation. Third is the branching of the cords. Fourth is the uh, formation. And uh, fifth is the um, canalization of cords. And uh, sixth is the cyto differentiation. Now, slavery gland's gross uh, morphology. Marking of slivery gland, uh, routed gland, larger slivery gland, 62 65 percent of total sliva, parameter uh, in shape, weights between 14 and uh, 28 gram. MCQs may your questions puchhe jate. Superficial portion of gland is uh, located subcutaneously. Uh, Subcutaneously in front of the external ear and deeper portion lies behind the ramus of the mandible. This is with the facial nerve. The clotted gland is a sniva to move the Bonsi duct se karega jo clotted gland ki duct hai, uska naam kya hai? Stenson's duct. Run forward it goes, masseter muscle turns inwards at the interior border of the masseter and opens at the papilla in oral cavity just opposite second maxillary molar prop. This is a clotted gland. This is a clotted duct. Clotted gland. Clotted gland. Once forward, it draws muscle. 
curtains inward at the interior border of the mesitra and opens at the papilla in oral cavity just uh, opposite second mesentery molar rock 5 cm to uh, into 3 cm a small portion of parotid uh, forms the accessory and this one Positive extension step just interior to the superficial portion of the gland. Of strike out the sensory supply greater auricular and auricular temporal nerve, parasympathetic supply loss of radial nerve, preganglionic fibers synapse in the optic ganglion, postganglionic fibers enter the gland to the auricular temporal nerve. Sympathetic supply, postganglionic fibers from plexus on external carotid artery or middle meningeal artery. Postpillar supply and nephritic uh, drainage, uh, arterial supply, external carotid artery, venous drainage, external jugular vein, lymphatic drainage, upper deep cervical lymph nodes. इस क्या होगा 10 to 15 ग्राम 30 percent of total saliva located at posterior portion of the floor of the mouth saliva gland located the posterior portion of floor of the mouth medial is a spread of mandible and wrapping around posterior border of the mylohyoid उथर The uh, submandibular gland, and the submand uh, submandibular duct. This is the bottom duct. Aki protrude duct. This is tension duct. Uh, this is the bottom duct. Let's try facial and lingual arteries. Protrude vein is submandibular lymph node and deep cervical lymph node. Blood supply, parasympathetic supply, facial nerve reaching gland through the lingual nerve and submandibular ganglion. Sympathetic supply, post ganglionic fibers from plexus on facial artery. Plants are uh, smallest major slimy gland with uh, two gram, uh, 2.5 percent of total saliva, located at the interior part of floor of the mouth, just between mucosa and mylohyoid muscles. The sublingual gland, the sublingual gland, this is the sublingual gland. Sublingual gland, smallest major slimy gland. Okay. क्या होगा जो टेम होगा और टू पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट जो है टोटल सिलाएगा होगा लोकेटेड एट द इंटीरियर पार्ट ऑफ फ्लोर ऑफ द माउंट जस्ट बिटवीन गोजा एंड माइलोहाइट मसल 
open into the oral cavity through the series of small ducts, ducts of filaments. The lingual glands ki jo duct hoga uska naam kya hoga duct of filaments. Aortic gland kya kya tha? Sensus duct tha aur uh, uh, mandibular cavities tha and uh, that is the duct of filaments uh, sublingual gland. Opening the long uh, sublingual gland. Uh, a sublingual fold and open uh, through large duct curtains that opens with the uh, the mandibular duct at uh, sublingual carinaca carinaca first supply sublingual and uh, submental arteries ventric drainage uh, submental uh, mental lymph nodes Nerve supply, parasympathetic supply, facial uh, nerve reaching gland through the lingual nerve and uh, subminimabular ganglion. Sympathetic supply, post ganglionic fibers from plexus on facial artery. I just love it and uh, no between sister and the 1000 uh, just as a uh, indicates uh, of uh, secretory tissue uh, present in uh, submucosa no uh, of the most of the oral cavity uh, not seen in gingiva and uh, interior part of heart palate In using uh, antibacterial proteins and uh, secretory amino proteins, uh, continuous slow secreting uh, gland uh, have an important role in protecting and moisturizing oral mucosa, especially when major salivary glands are mostly inactive. Epinous lingual serous gland located in the tongue and uh, open into the a uh, surrounding circumvalid papilla on the dorsum of the tongue and uh, at the foliate papilla on the side of the tongue. Secret digestive enzymes and uh, proteins uh, that uh, are thought to play a role in taste process. Use of their secretions cleans uh, the through and uh, preparation that uh, taste recommendations of the stimulus. This is the structure of saliva. This is also a series of secretory and phase or SNI connected to the oral cavity by a system of ducts. Secretory and phase or SNI consist of secretory cells which are arranged in a roughly spherical configuration around the central human heart cavity. So a great uh, diversity in size, shape, and cell number. Two types of cells are present, serial cells and microcells. Serial cells are present in some manipulated gland. Serial cells uh, are also present in uh, formations or at the, the uh, ends of the secreted tubules. Some the tissues of serial cells are uh, proteins, usually enzymatic, antimicrobial, calcium binding. So, the secretions of the serial cells are proteins, usually enzymatic, antimicrobial, calcium binding secretions. The PT and the consisting of serial cells are typically spherical. And they consist of uh, 8 to 12 cells surrounding the central neuron. Central Parameter in shape uh, with the thought base adjacent to connective tissue stroma and the uh, effect situated towards the central neuron. This spherical situated at the basal third of the cell, sometimes the uh, Sometimes the by depleted, uh, sometimes the by 
Cytoplasm stains the uh, intensely abidosylin and the apical cytoplasm is filled with the uh, secretory granules, uh, micromolecules, uh, components of uh, saliva. Hazel cytoplasm contains rough endoplasmic reticulum, uh, which converge towards the Golgi complex. Um, the complex located just apical the later to the nucleus. Also contain the cytoskeleton component. The lumen of sinus ends uh, face as a small extensions in the form of intercellular canaliculi formed between the adjacent serous cells. So the lumen and intercellular canali in a serous and face. Plasma membrane is a central uh, specialization. Uh, the surface of the cerebral uh, cells aligning the central lumen and canculi uh, processes uh, are dedicated microbi that extend into luminal and uh, generally processes. Uh, between this membrane and the plasma membrane may be increased by the complex folding. 0.5 microns of the basal plasma membrane. Uh, terminates in the, in the form of a classic uh, junction component, tight junction, zona oculatens, uh, zona oculatens, and uh, adherent junction, and the uh, desmosomes. Intercellular uh, uh, secretory uh, droplets, intercellular cancer cross section, the basic folds. The cells are predominant uh, cells, type of uh, the cerebral glands, uh, and most of minor slavic glands. As of the insulin gland, sec Patients consist of large amount of mucin, lubricants, uh, effective uh, indications of microorganisms. The critical component of uh, mucus cells is in a, uh, consists of found or a different configuration on larger lumen, larger than zero cells, pyramidal uh, in, uh, in shape, broader lumen in surface. The nucleus is situated towards its the base. Apical cytoplasm is filled with the uh, mucus secretory droplets, uh, stains poorly in a uh, metrosiding and uh, AOC, uh, pass air uh, um, SHM blue uh, positive. Mucus droplets are larger and uh, more irregular in shape. Electron lucent uh, droplets. Dominant uh, Golgi uh, complex also contains cytoskeleton components, uh, rough endoplasmic reticulum, mitochondria, uh, lysosomes, and uh, peroxides, but less prominent. Like serous cells, mucous cells are joined by the intercellular uh, junction, like intercellular can uh, can Evidence of cannulosy, mucus and SNI may be kept uh, at the blind end by presence of the several uh, cells. Uh, when uh, secretions reach uh, the lumen of the end faces uh, through the intercellular canculi, between uh, mucus cells at the end of the tubule. 
students this is a matrix cells bio epithelial the name is the basket cells Contractile cells located around the terminal uh, secretory and the first portion of the duct system interplated with the Located between basal lamina and the secretory are duct cells and are joined uh, by desmosomes, similar to smooth muscle cells. And they are still in a spider like uh, uh, with a flattened nucleus uh, surrounded by a small amount of uh, perinucleus cytoplasm and long branching process that embrace, uh, embrace uh, the secretory duct cells. Myoepithelial cells, intercalated duct, the secretory duct, and the basal lamina. The process uh, uh, are filled with the filaments of actin and myosin. Now we can amino state to demonstrate actin in the contractile myoepithelial cells. This is the actin. This then has numerous uh, initial of uh, contraction. Cellular ovaries are uh, located in the perinuclear cytoplasm. Only the nuclei is visible in ordinary hematoxylin and the uh, eosin se uh, section. Biopithelial cells related to intercalated ducts are more spindle shaped and uh, have few processes. Functions of saliva from secretory and face uh, cells. System. Contraction of myoepithelial cells of secreted ducts may shorten or widen the ducts, helping in maintaining their potency, maintaining cell polarity, and the structural integrity of secretory and pulses and face. Produce proteins that uh, have uh, tumor uh, suppressor activities such as uh, proteinase inhibitors, for example, tissue inhibitors uh, of the uh, metalloproteinase uh, and uh, anti agenogenesis, um, and uh, that cell may act uh, as effective invasive barrier against epithelial neoplasms. This is the ducts. Three types of the ducts present in the slavic gland. And number one is the intercalated, second is the striated ducts, and third is the terminus. Terminal secretory units open into a small duct uh, called the intercalated duct. These ducts join to form larger striated, uh, striated ducts, uh, which are finally empty into a larger excretory duct. System of a slavic gland main excretory duct. This is the main excretory duct open into the oral cavity. Excretory ducts are mostly located in the intertubular connective tissue. Seriated ducts, seriated ducts are the main intertubular ductal component. Interplated ducts. The intercalated duct vary in length and connect the secretory and face offices of the striated duct. Intercellular can rely are extensions of the of the uh, lumens of the uh, lumen of the end piece uh, between adjacent secreted cells. Uh, that serve to increase the luminal surface are available for secretion. Integrated ducts, small ducts into which secretory and basal is uh, lined by a single uh, layer of flow to vital cells and uh, myoepithelial uh, 
bodies and uh, their processes. Uh, overall, the emitter is uh, less than uh, security and piece, uh, uh, but the lumen is larger than security and piece. Centrally placed uh, nucleus, little uh, cytoplasm, rough endoplasm, uh, reticulum, and uh, uh, Golgi apparatus. A few secretory granules may be found in the um, cytoplasm. Species is located near the faces. A few microvilli projecting uh, into lumen. Joint adjacent cells by apical junction complexes and uh, scattered uh, desmosomes and uh, get junctions and have full process that uh, interagate with similar process of adjacent cells. Now, integrated as uh, uh, protein and then the shorter submandibular, uh, fully dwelt in the subliminal function. Kyoga channel for slavic flow. Contributes to the slavery secretion, lysosomes, uh, uh, lysozymes, and uh, lactophiles. Observe of uh, undifferentiated cells uh, that may undergo proliferation and uh, differentiation uh, to be replaced damaged uh, or dying cells in the end uh, and uh, striated ducts. Stradial ducts and uh, larger ducts tend to reach the intertubular ducts empty. Uh, main ductal components uh, in the intertubular uh, portion of the tank. The stradiated ducts Centrally uh, placed spherical, uh, centrally placed spherical nucleus, uh, pale uh, acidophilic uh, cytoplasm. Centrally uh, placed spherical nucleus, pale uh, acidophilic cytoplasm. Basal uh, striations are perpendicular to the base of the cells. Mitochondria uh, uh, are lying in cytoplasmic partitions produced by the enfoldings of the basal plasma membrane. The endoplasmic reticulum and uh, Golgi apparatus and few secretory granules and uh, uh, the sides of the um, uh, of the candidula, uh, of the candidula. short stubby microvilli at the luminal uh, surface joint adjacent cells by junctional complexes and uh, tight junction uh, but uh, lack gap junctions functions yoga modify the slavery secretions uh, changes from isotonic uh, to hypertonic, sodium resorption and uh, calcium and uh, potassium excretion. Okay, function kyaga modify the slavery secretions. Okay, changes from isotonic or hypertonic and uh, sodium kyaga uh, reabsorption or potassium kyaga excretion. Terminal aspiratory drugs. Three types of common ducts, but I think it's radiated ducts, integrated ducts, and terminal. Excreted ducts, as the striated ducts leave the individual glandular lobules and enter the interlobular connective tissue, they join to form the excretory duct. The main excretory duct, this is the excretory ducts, the striated ducts. Uh, interplated adders, caniculus uh, between this one, caniculus between cells, tubular, um, uh, tubular secretory and bases by face uh, and a spherical uh, secretory and base. Larger than stereotype ducts, mean secretory ducts leading from the uh, gland to the oral cavity is formed by the continued confluences of the ducts. 
Yes, related tags, they are lined uh, by pseudo uh, uh, striated with the uh, columnar cells and mixed with the small basal cells and goblet cells. With the smaller duct joined to form the larger ducts, uh, as uh, they approach oral cavity epithelium changes to a uh, striated, uh, sterified epithelium. Functions modify the final saliva by altering uh, its uh, electrolyte concentrations. Connected tissue uh, capsule, uh, capsule uh, demarcate the gland from adjacent stretches. Septa divide gland into lobes and lobules. Carry the nerves and blood vessels and excretory ducts. Fibroblasts, macrophages, uh, dendritic uh, cells, mast cells, plasma cells, adipose tissues. Collagen fibers and uh, elastic fibers uh, along with the glycoproteins and proteoglycans. Nerve supply follow the course of vessels to patterns. Intra uh, parietal type and extra parietal type. Intra parietal type axons leaves the nerve bundle, lose its when uh, cells investment, penetrate the basal, basal lamina and form an expanded swelling are very costly in uh, close contact 10 to 12 uh, nanometer to uh, basolateral membrane or between epithelial cells. For example, submandibular gland and the minor cervical gland of leg. Second is the extra uh, parietal type. Exons remain associated with the nerve bundle in the connective tissue, 200 to 12, uh, 200 nanometer from uh, epithelial cells. Uh, for example, clotted gland. Now, astrology of uh, major uh, slavic gland, uh, clotted gland, all serious. Fat cells may be seen. Okay, fat cells uh, are seen. Uh, long interclated ducts are seen. Okay, long, uh, long interclated ducts are seen. The mandibular gland uh, consists of scissors and uh, pieces uh, and the mucous tubules capped with serious uh, terminations. Serous cells significantly uh, out of number, uh, out of number the mucous cells. Pale staining, pale staining. Uh, the interclated and stretched ducts are less numerous than these in clotted, but uh, structurally similar. Uh, Sublingual uh, slavic gland uh, mixed with the mucous cell more. Uh, integrated ducts are short and difficult to uh, recognize. Intertubular ducts are fewer in number uh, than in the clotted or submandibular glands. Uh, some ducts may be like the in folding the characteristics. In minor cervical gland consists of uh, aggregates of the uh, secretory and uh, bases and uh, ducts organized into lobule-like structure in the submucosa are between muscle fibers of them, mostly mucus, occasionally uh, demilions. Salvi control Salvi control efferent pathways, uh, the rate of salvi gland secretions uh, may be affected by three principal factors. Number one is the local factor. Whenever the sensation of taste is stimulated, the slavery flow rate will increase. Local factors, the fibers carrying taste sensation pass along the quarter tympani, the lingual nerve, and the glossopharyngeal nerve. Glossopharyngeal nerve stimulation supply them posterior one third of the tongue, result mainly increased parotid slavery flow. Order company inputs and outputs appear similarly related. 
Six streamlined are the most effective slavery uh, flow stimulants, salt and the sweet slash so and the bitter uh, uh, the effective. Olfactory irritants uh, similarly cause increased slavery flow rates. Irritation of the oral mucosa can also result in increased salivation. Uh, this feature is most pronounced following new dentures or uh, orthodontic appliance insertion. In these later instances, uh, increased salivation is usually temporary, uh, although it may be uh, may initially alarm the patient. Uh, unilateral uh, proprioceptive uh, stimulation in the periodontal ligament. Muscles of mastication or uh, temporomandibular joint predominantly leads to the epsilateral increased slidey secretion. Emotional uh, psychic uh, stimuli, the uh, sight of food, taking about food, uh, the noise of food, preparation are sufficient to activate the uh, condition reflexes leading to increase uh, salivato. Uh, by contrast, uh, discussion are two uh, thought uh, about this like foods uh, may result in dimension, slavery secretion. Stimulations from other organs, also facial irritation causes the reflex salivation, uh, although gastric irritation leads to increase the salivation as a component of the nausea vomiting reflex. Central control, uh, the efferent stimuli are finally integrated in the cell bodies of uh, preganglionic promoter neurons. The cell bodies of sympathetic nervous system appear to lie in the lateral columns of the first five thoracic nerves with the slavery spinal reflex centers being uh, influenced by the medulla and uh, higher centers, for example, hypothalamus. The uh, nuclei of the facial and uh, glossopharyngeal nerves contain the cell bodies of the parasympathetic system. Uh, this area, the nucleus salivators, uh, comprises a uh, neuro, uh, neuronal uh, neural cluster in the particular formation extending from the facial nucleus uh, and because the nucleus salivators has been subdivided into two components. Salivators uh, superior uh, stimulation causes secretion from the epithelial uh, Nucleus salivators uh, inferior stimulation causes secretion from the epithelial rotic gland. Salivator efferent pathway. Up second, the efferent path. The control of salivation is mainly under parasympathetic control, although there may also be a sympathetic component. Passing through the facial nerve, parasympathetic fibers pass with the cord tympani to reach the lingual nerve and then synapsing uh, in the small nerves, short postganglionic fibers pass into the glands. The glossopharyngeal fibers pass through the companion and the lesser superficial uh, petrosal nerve to reach the aortic ganglion uh, where they synapse uh, with the postganglionic fibers of the auricular temporal nerve which supplies the rotted gland. Autonomic control, uh, the sympathetic fibers synapse in the superior cervical ganglion with post fibers then passing to all the slavic glands. Uh, the parasympathetic post ganglionic neurotransmitters uh, is uh, acetylcholine, where is that uh, of the sympathetic post ganglionic terminants in uh, norepinephrine. In addition to slavic secretions, the autonomic nervous system also exerts control over the glandular vestigial 
uh, respiratory tract activity and uh, myoepithelial cells. Uh, neural control of slightly gland function is therefore complex. No, uh, slavery gland because not be morphology and their types. I can do. next lecture is the saliva. Most important uh, topic to ask teachers some questions to ask in the slavery gland me uh, saliva functions, saliva uh, position, uh, mainly to uh, most important saliva. What are the types of the slavery glands? Slavery glands, the uh, uh, what types are? the types of slavic land this is a protein plan Major uh, plant and minor plants. Major plants concern or minor plants concern. Yes. Major slavery glands and the minor slavery glands. Some intravenous and some nasal glands in the major glands and minor. Minor slavic glands. The 
the types of drugs? इसमें स्लाइवी ग्लैंड्स में ड्रग्स आपको मैंने बताई हैं थ्री टाइप्स की होती हैं कौन कौन सी होती हैं types of drugs yes stereotypes stereotypes and interpreted that way आज की जो लेक्चर है कोई प्रॉब्लम इसमें है टुमारो स्टार्ट द स्लाइवा ये जो बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट है इसमें स्लाइवा में उसकी कंपोजिशन एंड फंक्शंस कल इंशाल्लाह इसको कंप्लीट करेंगे तो आपकी जो जस्ट के जो पेपर है उसके लिहाज से जो है या आपका जो स्लाइविक लैंड चैप्टर 11 जो है मोस्ट इम्पोर्टेंट आपकी ये चैप्टर 11 जो है आपके 10 के और ओरल फिजियोलॉजी की बुक है क्रिस्टोफर लेवाई की बुक उसमें से मैं स्लाइवा उसमें से आपको कवर करवाऊंगी ये दोनों आपका हिस्टोलॉजी और ओरल फिजिय आज के जो लेक्चर हैं इसको आप टेन केट्स में से पढ़ें आज के जो लेक्चर हैं ठीक है स्लाइवी क्लाइंट के चैप्टर अलेवेन टेन केट ठीक है और जो कल आपको मैं स्लाइवा पढ़ाऊंगी वो आपका टेन केट और आपकी जो ओरल फिजियोलॉजी की बुक है क्रिस्टोफर लिवाई उसमें से आपका अप्लाइड ओरल फिजियोलॉजी ठीक है उसमें से कवर करवाऊंगी ये आपके दोनों टॉपिक्स आपके एस्ट्रोलॉजी और ओरल फिजियोलॉजी का दोनों को कवर करेंगे ओके ओके अल्लाह फिज एनी क्वेश्चन Okay, love is...